Let's balance the equation P plus O2 gives us this P4O10. We'll also look at the type of reaction and the states. So let's start off with the type of reaction. We have two things coming together to form one new substance. That's going to be combination or synthesis. You could also say that it's a combustion reaction because we have O2 combining with the phosphorus here. Finally, you could say this is a redox reaction because phosphorus and oxygen have both changed their oxidation states. Let's balance the equation. One phosphorus and then two oxygens, product side, four phosphorus and 10 oxygen atoms. So we could balance the oxygen. All we have to do is put a five in front of the O2. Two times five, that would give us 10. So those are balanced. And the phosphorus, we have one phosphorus. So let's just put a four in front of that. One times four, that'll give us four. And we're done. This equation is balanced. If you need to write the states, phosphorus would be a solid, oxygen, that's a gas, and then this P4O10, tetraphosphorus pentoxide, that will also be a solid. This is Dr. B with the balanced equation for P plus O2 yields P4O2. We also looked at the states and the type of reaction. Thanks for watching.